Hey, this is Cookie the Cameraman live from the Guard Theater in New London, where we're about to see the inauguration of the new mayor for New London, Daryl Finizio. Hang out, check out, and we got a big crowd here tonight. Cookie the Cameraman, Tilly Street Chronicles. We inaugurate a new form of government here in the city of New London. And we honor this historical first by having at one time in one place here at the Historic Guard Arts Center the swearing in of the Board of Education, the New London City Council, and for the first time in over 90 years, a publicly elected mayor of the city.
Jason Cobb, having been chosen as a board member of the Board of Education for the City of London, do you swear that you will faithfully discharge the duties of the office according to your best skill and judgment so help you God? I do. Congratulations. <laughs> Sorry, Jack. Marvin Mary Kirk will be sworn in by Catherine Foley. Thank you. Meg, it is truly an honor to stand with you this evening as you once again pledge your service to your beloved city of London. It is also very fitting that this time your service is focused on children but throughout your life you have uplifted the younger generations as a friend, a mentor, and a passionate advocate. And so I ask you, Margaret Mary Curry, that having been chosen as a member of the New London Board of Education for the City of New London, do you swear that you will faithfully discharge the duties of the office according to your best skill and judgment so help you God? I do. Sylvia Farmer, having been chosen as a member of the Board of Education for the City of New London, do you swear that you will faithfully discharge the duties of the office according to your best skill and judgment? So help you God. So help you God. Jonathan, 
and the rest of my friends and family. I would like to recognize my husband, John, my boys, Gregory, John, my grandkids, Devante, Tamesha, Shabanda, my pastor, Pastor Larry DeLong, Mary Temple Church, our mother of the church, Mother DeLong, and my Miracle Temple family. Thank you, friends, who are here. God bless you. It's two years, but the rewards of persistence. Thank you. several years on the Board of Ed. He is a caring person, cares for children of New London, um, and I would be honored to have the board support to nominate Bill Morris as president of the board. Mrs. Gonzalez, do you second? Do you second? Are there any other nominations? Are there any other nominations? Are there any other nominations? I will say the nominations are closed. I will ask for a vote by Mr. Moore, so I'll be to say aye. 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 All opposed? Mr. Moore, you are now president of the board. I would like to nominate Liz Garcia Gonzalez as vice president of the New London Board of Education. Is there a second, Mrs. Muse? Second. Mrs. Garcia Gonzalez has been duly nominated in second. Are there further nominations? Are there any other nominations? Are there any other nominations? Hearing none, I will move the nominations to close and declare that Elizabeth Garcia Gonzalez is now the Vice President of the Board of Ed. that the Board of Ed appoint Jason Quintana as Secretary of the New London Board of Education for 2011 to 2012. Second. Mrs. Carter. Second on the Are there any other? Oh. Mr. District, I call the ball to Council Heisler, and I'd like to call forward his beautiful bride, Mrs. Jesse Heisler, to administer the order.
Having been chosen city councilor for the city of New London, do you swear that you will faithfully discharge the duties of the office according to your best skill and judgment, so help you God? I do. Congratulations. Who will be administrated and administered the oath of office by Ms. Evelyn Lotiotis. Would you raise your hand, please? Do you, John J. Nagan, having been chosen city councilor for the city of New London, do you swear or affirm that you will faithfully discharge the duties of the office? According to your best skill and judgment. So Absolutely. Absolutely. Marie Freeze McFerrin, and she would be administered the over by Ms. Michelle Allen. the duties of this office according to your best skill and judgment, so help you God, I do. Anthony L. Nolan, who is the Minister of the Oath of Secretary of State, and he's the The Bible will be held by Having been chosen city councilor for the city of New London, do you swear that you will faithfully discharge the duties of the office according to your best skill and judgment and of the God? I do. Michael E. Castro, and the oath would be administered by Ms. Jerry Benton. Chosen City Council for the City of New London, do you swear that you will faithfully discharge the duties of the office according to your best skill and judgment? So help you God. I will. <laughs> Adam Spagatti, having been chosen City Councilor of the City of New London, do you swear that you will faithfully discharge the duties of the office according to your best skill and judgment to help you God? I do. Thank you. In the first order of business for the council is election of a council president, Councilor Freeze McFerrin. Good evening. Tonight I make history in New London. The role and power of the City Council has changed. The New London City Council, as the legislative body of our local government, acts as the point and check of and balance for the governing of our city. We have a great responsibility to New London and to the people that elect us to serve them. The City Council President will lead the Council and must be someone with demonstrated leadership skills, a proven commitment to the entire community, and a record of public service. Over the years, I have witnessed firsthand the commitment to New London by Michael Pasco. Michael is a lifelong resident of New London. He was a lifeguard at Ocean Beach. He is a New London firefighter, a labor attorney, and a veteran city council. You do not have to look far to see how deeply involved in the city of New London Michael Pasco is. For this, and far too many reasons to this, it is an honor for me to place into nomination for the president of the City Council of New London, the name of Mr. Michael Pasco. Are there any other nominations? Are there any other nominations? 
Second. It's been moved and properly seconded that the nomination be closed. We call for the vote on Michael Pasco for president of the city council. All those in favor signify by saying aye. aye. Those opposed, the ayes have it. being elected president of the city council for the city of New London, do swear by the name of the everlasting God that you will faithfully and uprightly discharge the duties of that office, so long as you shall hold the same, so help you God.
bring to order. God bless you.
city of New London. Gentlemen. Attorney Fidesio, are you prepared to take the oath of office? Yes, Mr. Clerk, I am. Please raise your right hand and repeat after me. I, Daryl Justin Fenizio, do solemnly swear. I, Daryl Justin Fenizio, do solemnly swear. That I will protect and preserve the charter of the city of New London. That I will protect and preserve the charter of the city of New London. And will faithfully discharge the duties and responsibilities. And will faithfully discharge the duties and responsibilities. Of the office of mayor of the city of New London. Of the office of mayor of the city of New London. According to my best skill and judgment. According to my best skill and judgment. So help me God. So help me God. Congratulations, Mr. Mayor. Leadership. 
I commit to you that all that I am, indeed, now, my very life, belongs to New London. I will endeavor always and ever, each day, to not let you down. However, no one person can do this alone. Our entire government, those in elected and appointed offices, down to every employee in every department, must give our all to the great and weighty tasks that lay before us. So too must every single New Londoner give their all to aid in our city's rebirth. Work for all of us. But to those who have waited, waited for so long, for the moment to come when New London might finally turn that corner. The moment when the great power of the people in this city might be at last unleashed. I say to all of you that this is that moment. This is our chance. This is our time tonight.
Gonçalo! Kennedy. 